Hi, I'm Suresh and I'm back again for Susan Dot N. In previous video, we discussed about web location, local host, and PHP my admin. In this video, we will discuss about my first page, PHP extension, combining HTML with PHP, index.php, and final index.php. So First, I will <coughs> click on web server and this green indicate that server is online. Click on that and click on local server. And here we will go to your project and not able to see anything here. So I will minimize it. Now I will open Notepad. And uh, I will save file as uh, my first page dot php. And here PHP is the extension of uh, programming language, so I will save it and see in WAM in www I have told you that www is important folder and why we will see here I will create a folder and uh, I will name it Susan first page yeah web and I will click on save and I will open it and here I will save my file now what I will do I will go again to localhost and here I will refresh it oh here we can see a folder a directory of Susan first web and I have I will click on that here I can see the page which I created that was my first page dot php now what I will do uh, I will tell you one more thing that uh, if you just want uh, there are uh, two ways of uh, php extension you can write it uh, sorry. PHP okay what you have to do just remember it and go here and click here this code or you can use this one to basically we use uh, this this one that these code or in if you want to use another that is sorry okay. I will go down and I will write down it okay. and uh, question mark yes. but usually we use uh, this code this one and like this so this was the extension of PHP, uh, the code of PHP, and uh, <coughs> now we will, if we just want to add HTML with PHP, what we will do? We will simply write this code, and after that we will write HTML and gain HTML. This is the way of connecting PHP with HTML. Now, I will create going to create another page named index.html. This is an important page of any website. Whenever you uh, just go to a site, the first page is index.php. So I will write here index.php. 
the first thing which you should notice is that just go here when we click citizen first page we have this directory and we are able to access this page my first page got php by clicking that we have nothing to say here and when we create this page index.php now we will go here and refresh it we cannot see anything so that what I just want to show you that after saving index.php file we can access directly index.php file without writing the index.php file now if you just want to access okay before that I will go to index.php file okay and here I will simply uh, just want to echo a notification I will just simply uh, echo a notification for that I will just write code between it or should I write if you are <coughs> introduced with HTML you can understand but will do hello my page hello to my page and what simple and simply semicolon and click save it and now I will go to Swizzen page and here we that is hello to my page and if you just want to access your uh, first made page that was, the, that was in my first page just write here my first page dot php and you have the page so you can access it in another way but main page is index.php indirectly you are not able to see the page uh, that was my first page not php so that is enough for the session and next video we will learn a little bit all till then goodbye